uh, you go into a year and the expectation is I hope we can win a game to being able to win eight was uh, a dramatic and uh, you know dramatic turnaround and uh, it was fun to watch our coaches and our kids be able to enjoy that type of success uh, it's something that you felt like was possible at our place but hadn't been done in a while and uh, so a magical year and, and now you look to add to it I think we'll be more talented. Uh, I, I think that the question, I think this league will be more talented as well. So uh, each and every week you'll have a battle. Um, you've got expectations now as a program. Uh, so you're trying to make sure that th th this is kind of uncharted territory for us where you got a bullseye on your back. And so our guys need to be prepared to, to handle it and uh, make sure that they're putting in the preparation to have a chance to be successful. Um, but but I feel good about the guys we have coming back. I think you're seeing how the team gels, how the new coaches gel with one another, and uh, so there's a lot of question marks. But uh, it's the way it should be. I mean, I think we got a chance to do something really special, but uh, we got to prove it each and every Saturday. I like the expectation that this team is going to have to live up to. I, I think it's great for these guys to to have to deal with this pressure. Uh, obviously tried to put as much pressure as I could on them a year ago. And, uh, you know, you get down to games at the stretch there, like, uh, you know, Eastern Illinois and, and some of those games you played late. There's a lot of pressure in that. you got to win those games to feel like you're keeping your playoff hopes alive. Uh, so dealing with that pressure I'm looking forward to. Uh, I, I, again, I think we've got really good talent. Uh, I look forward to continuing to develop leadership among this group uh, where it becomes, you know, a, a player-led team and, and uh, their own team. Um, but uh, – and then obviously playing in front of 100,000 people between the hedges uh, will be a lot of fun to get it kicked off. What do you say is the biggest challenge for this team uh, to reach your goals? You know, I, I just think that the – the way this group is going to come together every every year is totally different. Uh, you know, we lost four coaches um, to, to great opportunities, and so now you, you've hired four ones that I feel very good about. Uh, you got a new signing class. You got a couple guys that uh, joined us mid year. So, is the group as hungry as it was a year ago? Uh, are they ready to handle the expectations? Can you go from a good year to a good program? Uh, and for me, that's what this year's about. I, I think we had a great 2017 season. That's awesome. But can you build something that's sustainable in this league at our place? Uh, and, and so, and, and when everybody's going to give you their best shot. I mean, um, you know, let, let's be honest. I, I know people were uh, for, are gunning for us. I know people are excited about playing us. We're not circled for the homecoming game anymore. We're circled uh, is a game that people want to win. And I look forward to that challenge. Uh, I think it's it's awesome, and it's something that uh, we expected to happen at Austin P. And I don't want our kids to run from it. I mean, this is life. Uh, I want expectations on these kids to be great, and uh, this year is no different. What, what are the general impressions of the OEC race overall this year? Uh, obviously, everybody's gunning to beat Jacksonville State. Uh, you know, they've created a standard and an expectation at their place that everybody's trying to to match. Um, I think the league from top to bottom is extremely talented. Uh, there are really good coaches in this league. Uh, and so I, I know how hard it is to win games. Listen, I lost my first 13. So, uh, I, you know, each and every week will be a dogfight. Everybody can beat you. Uh, we were fortunate to win some games late last year. Uh, and, and it will be very difficult to do it again this year. So um, I, I know talented teams, really good rosters, really good coaches, uh, and some very difficult road matchups as well for us will, uh, will be difficult. But, uh, again, that's why you play the game on Saturday.